Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome to All The Things. <clears throat> Sorry, we got a kind of extreme close-up. Let's move away just a little bit. There we go. Let's do a hot sauce. It's been a while. I thought about doing some beers, but I don't have anything new for real. Well, my doctor picked this up. This is kind of a mainstream uh, hot sauce, really. Uh, not something I normally do, but I never had this one, so I thought I would give it a whirl. Tabasco habanero version. Uh, we all know that the Tabasco regular sauce, kind of vinegary, uh, not very hot for real. Uh, you, you know, good to throw in some soups on some oysters. I prefer crystals on oysters, but whatever. But I thought we'd jump into this one. Let's try it. We'll do a spoonful. Porter was going to do this, but he's at school. Mm, I didn't feel like waiting. Here we go. Kind of thin. Got some pepper flakes in there, though. Surprisingly warm, though. Uh, nice tomato base. Vinegary. Sweet. A little smoky. Kind of fruity, even. A lot of habanero, though. A lot. Very tasty. Um, quite a bit hotter than regular Tabasco, though. I mean, decent amount. I'd put this like, I think regular Tabasco is probably like a two, and this is probably like a five, somewhere in the middle. Like, a good amount of heat that's making like my mouth water a little bit. No sweating. Nothing uncomfortable. But pretty nice flavor. And I'll say this. It's less vinegary than the regular Tabasco. It's much more pepper forward and smoky. I'd be shocked if there's not some Chipotle peppers in there. Let's see. So distilled vinegar, first ingredient, then habanero peppers. I believe that. Cane sugar, Tabasco brand pepper sauce, salt, mango puree. There's some little sweetness, that's what I said. Dehydrated onion, banana puree, tomato paste. Tamarind uh, puree, papaya puree. Yeah, I don't see any. There's some smoking that's coming from something. Maybe it's that Tabasco pepper sauce, their trademark uh, pepper blend that they use. But um, yeah, tabac Tabasco brand pepper mash, aged red pepper. So maybe who knows? From um, yeah, a decent amount of sweetness though. Uh, I don't. I don't know how to put that. But it's it's well balanced with the heat though. It's not overly sweet. But for an off-the-shelf, this was a gift to me, by the way, from a doc that I work with. Um, I have no complaints about this sauce. I will use it. I would actually put this on just about anything that you would that you'd consider putting hot sauce on. Eggs. I like my eggs with hot sauce. Soups, of course. Burgers. This would be great on a burger. Maybe even like in your like if you had some uh, shrimp. I can see this being good with shrimp. Fish. Um, definitely crawfish would be good and I think this is a little bit for me I think it's a little too warm to put on oysters I would prefer regular Tabasco or Crystal's Tabasco but I don't know it's just good it's an overall good sauce that apparently you can buy on the store shelf so if you're into it check it out it's Tabasco Habanero thanks for checking it out let's get into some beer soon it's summertime right Drill, rolling up on the 80 degrees see if I can get some new stuff in who knows? Till next time, y'all. Peace.